Fish. Hey guys, what's going on? Inception here, and welcome to another video. Ladies and gentlemen, we have the new Mario Goetze card to review today. So, we're taking a look at a card who is 5 foot 10, medium, medium work rates, right footed, 4 star skills, 4 star weak foot. Now, the first thing that you notice with uh, Mr. Goetze's card is his uh, base card stats for dribbling, right? Does he have his own body type? Average body type. Okay, so average body type with 82 agility doesn't look too crazy so far. Uh, what I will say is that maybe for a potential upgrade in the future, if you are mainly going to be using him in the cam position, maybe if you give him a finisher chemistry style, depending on how much they improve the pace, then it would be perfectly fine. You just wouldn't be able to utilize long shots as much as possible. But does he have traits to even have that? He has a finesse shot trait. Okay. Yeah, because finesse shot traits for a card like this, who's 5'10 average body type on a Hawk, I feel like improving that as much as possible could be super ideal. But then the dribbling would be untouched. Agility at an 82, but the other dribbling stats of the card is in a pretty decent area. Very unfortunate circumstances, because honestly, they should have given him like a 90 for agility. For an Eredivisie player, why not? You know what I'm saying? Uh, but yeah, the card with the shooting... On the Hawk chemistry style will be in a pretty decent area. We'll try out some certain angles. Uh, passing, very good on the card, especially at a 94 for composure. So no problem there whatsoever. The card actually has some defensive capabilities, which is pretty cool. What does he look like on a shadow? Oh, it's still... I mean, it's still... It's, it's like usable, to be honest. Like, if you're using him as an attacking oriented center mid for the fun aspect, right? You could totally do that if you want. 87 stamina, you have to use this card mainly through the middle, unless they improve the base card stats for that as well. Um, dribbling, we will be experimenting with, although I do feel like the agility with the average body type is going to affect it a lot. We'll see. Maybe it surprises me. Um, defensive stats, he has some, which, like I said, is pretty decent. And then he has some physical capabilities too, right? With the strength being improved and the aggression at a 78, right? So, um, yeah, we'll see how he plays. In Giyu's case, he can finally replace uh, that one guy that was playing at striker in Mecca or whatever. That card is just... Um, yeah, so 3412, switch that. This is the old one. So 50, 55, 50. This is that speed of the 60. And yeah. Okay, so because this is a review, we're just going to go ahead. I always forget that uh, my boy has Balak. I probably should do his review at some point. Gunter. Sule we'll put over here, Gunter over here, Lam we have to play in the middle here. Yeah, this guy's got to play here. And then we'll do that. Gotsa, Baku. Gozens is here too, eh? Gozens we'll have to put over here. Yeah, that works. We could do that. This ballot card is, must be really sick. Let me see. So we'll get him behind state forward for the strikers. Okay, cool beans. Let's go try them out, guys. Hmm, I got the green on that. Unfortunate with the block. I will say, guys, that by default, I do feel the agility of the card being super low, for sure. Almost worked that angle there. Maybe on a green, I actually hit it directly. Maybe. These corner kick tactics, I feel like I can't do anymore. Unless there's like a specific number I need to have it on for the corner kicks. I don't know. Because these guys are always blocking this opportunity now. Okay, so we got a finesse shot there on a green. But it's still kind of like based in the middle a little bit. Because I, I think it's because of the long shots not being, like, super high. Oh, I try to hit him with the dribble, dribble. But, you know, Ruben Diaz, he do be, he do be a different breed. Oh, man, that dribbling is a rough, my G. It do be rough, it do be rough. More in the middle. Okay, so I have to just aim it a little bit more to the side. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Mm, 
Okay. So even on a first time strike, we didn't get much there. Cool beans, cool beans. Made a Varan dance there, eh? Oh, imagine. <laughs> oh, that would have been nice, dude. Would have been nice. Oh, I got him on the shot cancel there, too. I'm lucky. Mizzou with the pass, though, eh? That was kind of nuts. There we go. We got one. We got one, boys. We got one. Let's go. Do you imagine if I actually got a double drag back there with Gutsa with his dribbling? <laughs> oh, he actually wins the ball in the air. Oh my goodness. <laughs> that sliding out of animation, I really, really dislike, man. I really dislike it. It's so, like, you would think it's, the, oh, he's saving the ball, but he, it's just an unnecessary animation, honestly. Oh, foul. Give me the foul, bro. Good, so he doesn't know how to dribble. Don't worry about it. I actually thought I was going to score that. I was like, bro, he just comes out of nowhere. He's, like, completely behind the player, and I still got that pass off. That did not warrant uh, for me to get that ball there at all. That was so random. Sheesh! Oh, what I would do for that to actually go in. <laughs> that would have been crazy. Oh, yeah. His, his finesse shots, guys, because he needs that boost is like, it, they're not that crazy. Like I'm hitting them because it's like green time shots and stuff, you know, not because he's like crazy at hitting them, if, if that makes sense. Like he has a trade, but he needs those stats to be improved as much as possible for sure. Oh, that's one way to pick up the ball. <laughs> Oh, I really try to get the timing there because I really don't want him to like head the ball. Sometimes they do that, man. I'm not about that life, my G. Oh, Ronaldo on defensively. Yo, chill. Let me get this ball. Let me get this ball. A little bit of pressure. Okay. <laughs> yeah, right, dude. <laughs> uh, I love to try the stupid angles, man. You know me, guys. Oh, you didn't expect the dribble. You didn't expect the dribble. By the way, I totally forgot to record the first goal that I scored. Just don't dribble that much with him. Because if you do, you're probably going to want to cry. That was a well-weighted pass by Goodsa. We'll take that. Okay, guys. So final verdict on the Mario Goodsa card. So definitely a card that needs an upgrade for sure. 100% without a shadow of a doubt. Um, here's the thing. Okay. So what this is what I'm going to explain to you guys. This card will be usable in the gameplay if you actually play him in the cam position and you give him a finisher chemistry style and you don't mind the long shots being on the lower side. Because, guys, uh, if he gets an upgrade in the future, right? What's the best they can do with this card? If you give them an engine chemistry style, 
they have to boost base card stats for shooting like crazy, right? If you give them a finisher chemistry style, the long shots and the pace is still really, really low. So this is gonna be the type of SPC where, you know, normally I would call it a concept card, but this is like, I, I think he's worse than a concept card, if I'm being completely honest with you. Like the only reason I could see someone doing this SPC is because it's Mario Goodso. Because last year they released uh, a version of his card, I think it was last year or two years ago, that was actually like pretty solid for the meta of the game. Was it this? Was it this one? Yeah, like take a look at this card, right? Like this card, obviously, at some point when they released him in the game, like if you're making an Era Divisi squad, some German team or whatever, like this guy was pretty solid for what it was with the five star skills and whatnot. But yeah, this card that they released today is nowhere near in comparison. It's just not an SPC I would complete, even if he were to get the upgrade. But obviously, if you're doing an Era Divisi team, I would obviously recommend giving him the finisher chemistry style or, you know, an engine, and then they improve the base card stats for his card in certain ways where he could be as usable as possible, right? Like, it, it really, really requires the upgrade, 100%. So, uh, I, I scored a goal with him, and that was actually pretty nice, and I didn't even bother getting the replay for him because it was just frustrating me to use his card. Like, that's how much I didn't like him, to be honest with you. But, um, yeah, hopefully you guys enjoy this video today. I'll catch you guys for the next one. Peace out, dudes. Love you guys.